Hi, my name is Devupriya. I'm a third year PhD student in the Department of Veterinary and Biomedical Sciences. I work with Dr. Gary Perdue's research group and I'm very excited to talk about my research. My research focuses on how components in our diet can play an important role in maintaining our intestinal health through activation of a specific receptor called the aryl hydrocarbon receptor and how such activation can help protect the intestine from challenges such as those induced by chemotherapeutic drugs such as doxorubicin. The chemotherapeutic drug doxorubicin is widely used and its use is somewhat limited by the profound side effects it has in the intestine. So I want to see whether through manipulation of our diet such side effects can be reduced. For this I use mouse model and I perform these dietary, dietary manipulations in mice. I also garbage the mice with specific compounds such as ICZ which are present in cruciferous vegetables because cruciferous vegetables such as broccoli contain compounds that activate this aryl hydrocarbon receptor which has previously been shown to play an important role in maintaining the intestinal epithelial structure and integrity. I show that through, my, uh, through the dietary manipulation in mice um, there is an increase in uh, differentiation of specific intestinal epithelial cells that are important for maintaining the intestinal function and I also show that there is increased expression of proteins such as tight junction proteins which maintain the intestinal barrier structure and integrity. Now my next aim is to see whether challenging these mice with doxorubicin uh, causes disruption of the intestine and whether uh, these mice when fed with cruciferous vegetables such as broccoli can reverse this toxic effects caused by doxorubicin through activation of the aryl hydrocarbon receptor. Uh, I hope you found my work interesting because the ultimate goal of my work is to find a readily available and cost effective way to continue usage of these chemotherapeutic drugs through dietary manipulation um, using various dietary compounds. Thank you.